Happening right now, a national march dedicated to fighting police brutality is taking place at the state capitol, the Justice and Accountability March, created by Stevante Clark. Uh, this is to honor the passing of his brother from four years ago. ABC 10's Becca Habiger and ABC 10's Marcus Allen are live at the state capitol. Some big names in the lineup today. Glad you're both there. And they have to know. Yeah, well, it's absolutely. You know, we're going to be hearing from the Reverend Al Sharpton later this afternoon, as well as famed civil rights attorney Ben Crump, who represents the family of George Floyd, the man who was murdered in Minneapolis by Minneapolis police back on Memorial Day of 2020. You know, this whole event is a march for justice and an event for justice uh, commemorating the life of Stephon Clark. As you recall, four years ago, he was killed by two Sacramento police officers. Uh, they were following him on suspicion of potential car break-ins. Uh, he ran to his grandfather grandmother's backyard where uh, they, they followed him and they shot him and since then there has been a lot of change a lot of protest in our community certainly protest in the wake of that shooting but then protest a year later after Sacramento County District Attorney Anne Marie Schubert said she would not be pressing charges against those two officers lots of protests there but not only protests a lot of community-based change has happened Stevante Clark and his mother Sequette Clark in honor of Stefan Clark formed the I am SAC foundation that is part of social justice causes and events here in the Sacramento area. They also started Stefan's House. It's a place for healing and resources in the black community here locally. You know, also in 2019, Governor Newsom signed what's called the Stefan's Law, Stefan Clark's Law. It's AB 392. It expanded the police accountability and the it, it raised the standards for when police can use deadly force uh, when, when you know, pursuing a suspect. Um, some of the strictest uh, standards for using deadly force in the nation. Uh, you know, in the wake of that, Stevante Clark, Stefan's brother, had said that the bill was watered down. It was not perfect, but it's a step in the right direction. So, you know, certainly we're hearing from Stevante this morning. He was on stage just a few minutes ago. Uh, Mark, you're going to be talking with him and his mother, Sequette, in just a few minutes later on in, in, in the newscast here. Um, you know, this is a place where we'll, we will certainly probably see more and more folks gather uh, as the day goes on. Yeah, it's so true. And I had crossed paths with Stevante and his brother before we knew them before they were world famous because of this tragedy uh, and so it was with warm embrace that I saw him this morning as he took to the stage and said some passionate words that started drawing the crowds I think earlier we had wondered are the crowds coming indeed the moment these passionate speeches hit the stage the crowds came I talked to the event organizer Dion Taylor a big filmmaker about why this needs to be heard take a listen my name is Dion Taylor I'm a local from Sacramento I'm a filmmaker Deion Taylor's not just a filmmaker, he's made some of the most poignant and successful films in worldwide distribution in the last five years. Let me ask you a question. You think you black? Stars like Naomi Harris, George Lopez, Dennis Quaid, Michael Ely, Oscar winner Hilary Swank lining up to work with him. But as compelling as his movies are, his real mission is to compel you, motivate you in the real world. This event twofold. One, we are honoring those lives that were tragically lost, embracing their families, but more importantly, we're trying to prevent. Prevent and make sure that it doesn't happen again. You know, from Oscar Grant to, of course, the, you know, the Clark family here locally, mm -hmm. uh, Ahmaud Arbery, uh, George Floyd, all these families are coming down, you know, for this moment of celebration, but also to push back the energy to make sure people know it's like, you, you, we can't keep allowing this to happen. Answer this question, two questions. If you're black, you need to be at this march because, if you're not black, you need to be at this march because. Yeah, look, it's, it's not a black or white thing. It's a right and wrong thing. I think we're past the world of, oh man, if you black, you gotta do this. If you white, you got, like, no, it's, it's, it's a moment where we need everyone to stand up. You know, celebrate these people that are continuing to fight and they continue to, burn the torch of, you know, fighting for justice and find out what you can do to be effective in your community and what you can do. It only takes one person in one community to start making some noise and doing some things to help and create change. Great words. It only takes one person. And again, think about Deion Taylor. We, we've seen people like Deion Taylor. He's a huge filmmaker. He could have moved out of town, long forgotten about this, but his passion is still there. Rather than being trapped in a studio or on a set, he's back up here making this happen. Yeah, absolutely. A lot of people coming out to support. You know, people coming from all over, too. Just before this live shot, I spoke with a man who made his way all the way down from Chico. He said his son was killed by police in that area back on St. Patrick's Day of 2017. So he's here to join in these voices to help raise a 
awareness for the situation that his that happened to his son. Later up, uh, coming up on the ABC 10 News at 5, 6, and 6.30, uh, my colleague, ABC 10 Race and Culture lead reporter Candace Red and I will have coverage of today's event and take a look back on what has changed since Stefan's Clark, Stefan Clark's killing four years ago. So we'll have a lot more coverage, including coming up in this hour in this newscast as Mark talks to Stevante uh, and Sequoia Clark. Okay, Becca, Mark S. Well, Allen live you. out at the uh, state capitol, west side. Thank you both.